Hello and welcome to this lesson. In this lesson we will learn, the basic architecture, of the control plane. The control plane includes, the AMF, the SMF, the AUSF, the UDM, and the PCF. First, let's learn, the AMF. AMF refers to, access, and mobility, management function. From its name, the AMF performs access management, and mobility management, for the UEs. The main function of the AMF includes, access authentication and authorization. Mobility management. Control plane termination point, for the RAN. And, NAS messages, termination point. Access authentication and authorization, means that, the AMF authenticates the UEs, and authorizes them, to be able, to access the 5G network. This is done, in coordination with, the AUSF, and, the UDM. Mobility management means that, the AMF knows, the location of the UE, and manages the mobility of the UE, while the UE, is moving, from one location, to another. Control plane termination point means that, the AMF, is the first point in the control plane, that the G node B, connects to. An AS messages termination point, means that, the messages, between the UE, and the AMF, are named, NAS messages, which refers to, non-access, straight up messages. This link, between the AMF, and the UE, is a logical link. Which means that, the AMF, has no direct link, to the UE. Instead, the AMF, sends and receives, NAS messages, to and from, the UE, through, the G node B. The G node B, transparently, forwards the NAS messages, between the UE, and the AMF. Next let's learn, the AUSF. The AUSF refers to, authentication server function. The AUSF is responsible, to authenticate the UEs. The AMF, connects to the AUSF, in order to authenticate the UE. And during the authentication procedure, the AUSF, may connect to the UDM. So, the main function, of the AUSF, is to authenticate, the UEs. Next let's learn, the UDM. UDM refers to, Unified Data Management. It provides, UE subscription information, to other network functions, when needed. UE subscription information includes, as example, the data networks, that the UE is allowed, to connect to. The UDM, does not have a database, to store the subscription information, of the UEs. So, there is another node, named, the UDR. UDR, refers to, Unified Data Repository. And it is the database, that stores, the subscription information, of all UEs, in the network. So that, the UDM connects, to the UDR, in order to retrieve subscription information, of the UEs. So that the UDM, delivers this subscription information, to other network functions, when needed. Next let's learn, the SMF. SMF refers to, Session Management Function. The SMF, is responsible to, UE data sessions. It establishes, modifies, and terminates, the PDU sessions, established between the UE, and, the UPF. The SMF, provides the UPF, the G node B, and the UE, with session management related parameters, needed to establish and control, the PDU session. In addition, the SMF, selects, and controls, the UPF, that should be used, to establish the PDU session. Next let's learn, the PCF. PCF refers to, policy control function. The PCF, provides, a unified policy framework, to control, network behavior. The PCF, is responsible to generate and control, all policies, that control network behavior. It provides the SMF, with session management policies. And provides the AMF, with access and mobility, management policies. And provides the UE, with, UE policies. The UDR, stores, the UE subscribed policy information, for all the UEs, in the network. So, the PCF, may access the UDR, in order to retrieve policy information, for the UE. And then, generates all related policies, and delivers them, to other network functions. In summary, the AMF, is responsible, for access and mobility management, for the UEs. The SMF, is responsible for, session management. It establishes and controls, the PDU sessions. The AUSF, is responsible, 
to authenticate the UEs. The UDM is responsible to provide UE subscription information of the UEs to other network functions when needed. And the PCF is responsible to generate and control all policies that control the network. Thank you and see you in the next lesson.